Hi Sagittarius, welcome back to my channel and Happy New Year! Woo! I'm here to do your January videos, messages, so I already laid out your cards to save some time. And I must say, you are in for some really good things. Okay, let's start with the two cards that came out first. The first one we have is the Two of Flames, which is the Two of Wands. Um, this is talking about the energy of really looking for, towards your future. What is it that you want? Looking in on your successes, your work life, your love life, everything. What is it that you want to do? It's kind of like you are examining certain things. What can you do to um, enhance those things so that you can become better at it? Uh, looking to the future, right? With positivity and optimism. We also have the Eight of Crystals, which is the Eight of Pentacles. It's like whatever it is that you're working on, you're making sure that it's growing. It's definitely growing. You are adding to it so that you can make that part of your um, success or your life to blossom and to be more successful. You're definitely nurturing it. You're watering your seeds. You're watching it grow and you are just adding and adding and adding. So we also have here, which is the where is this at? Oh, no, I'm going to leave that for later. We have the dreams card. Okay, we have the dreams card and the imagine card. I was like, wow, these two cards came out together. What are the odds? So we're going to do the imagine. It says, what would you see, feel, think, and hear if your wish came true? Using your imagination, your dreams as well. What are your goals, your dreams? What is it that you've been trying to manifest? I definitely feel you've been working really strongly with law of attraction. And when you are checking in on your goals and everything or making plans, you're definitely dreaming big. You're dreaming big. This is something you've been wanting to do for quite some time. You're making your goals. You're staying focused. You're watering your plants. And, and then we have the Queen of Spring, which is the Queen of Wands. That's you, Saggy. And it says, brilliant, loyal, talented, and friendly. It says, believe in yourself. And that's a huge thing for you. You have to believe in yourself. Wonderful people want to help you ma maintain a balance between work and home life. You, knowing you, you can do it all. You know what I mean? Balance it out. There's nothing wrong with the little balance. You have to have balance because when things are out of balance, it just becomes crazy and you just you just don't want to go down that, okay? <laughs> we have the Atlantis card here. The Atlantis card is talking about rapid development, okay? Excellence and success. There's something that you've been working on okay that is going to just pop off you are definitely rising above everything is going to be um it's kind of like your wishes or your hard work is going to pay off and you are finally going to see the abundance and the success that it comes from that hard work okay and definitely i feel like if it hasn't been you know picking up for you it's about to pick up for you in a really really fast pace and you are going to freaking love it, okay? Then we have the Three of Autumn, which is the Three of Pentacles. It says, follow your passion when it comes to your career. Mm-hmm, your passion. Follow your dreams, too. It says, best, be best at what you do and uh, being compensated for your creative talents. You see, you definitely are going to be compensated, especially with the success card here. That's because you have been putting in the work. You've been working hard. You've been checking in on things. You're making sure that it, it's going to benefit you in the long run for your future. So what you imagine, you co-create. What you think, you bring about. What you, uh, what you believe in, you, you achieve. And so on and so forth. So the card that came out for you from the Queen of Moon Oracle is the Blossoming card, which is awesome because you are definitely growing everything that you have been I feel like yourself is you're growing as a human being in general you're growing in love and career and family because you are pinpointing things that are missing you're pinpointing things that need to be watered and you are doing just that so it says do not give up you have planned for this mm -hmm. take no notice of what others think or say about you open and rise okay open and rise and yes you did plan for this already 
open your eyes. Someone around you might be jealous of your success and mark your victory. So pay attention to whoever it is that's around you that has been, you know, jealous of you. They could be low-key jealous and they're not telling you, especially if they find someone who's very talented and sexy and, and very driven uh, to succeed. And they, when they finally see that you do that and you don't let nothing or no one stop you, they could have a little envy. So be careful with those because when they try to give you the evil eye, they will try to stop you, even though they can't because what's meant for you will never pass you by. But they will try to bring, you know, roadblocks around you so that you can and to push you off your path so be be very careful and mindful of that but we do have success success and growth here so keep dreaming big and, and, and keep imagining daydreaming your goals daydreaming your co-creating it uh, speaking it into existence right so the last card that came out for you is from the heart and soul oracle cards these are heart shaped cards this one came out for you it says you may not be aware of it yet but a tapestry full of positive outcomes and spiritual blessings now permeat, permeats your aura. The gray clouds have lifted, replaced by soft, radiant light. The past will soon be behind you. Let it go and embrace the positive times ahead. I mean, your spread is freaking amazing. To be honest with you, it's one of my favorites so far. <laughs> So go you, keep that fire, keep that ambition, dream big and stay focused and you'll be platinum and golden. Okay, Sagittarius, so give it a thumbs up, like, share, and subscribe, and I will see you guys in your next video. Bye-bye!